Cardi B, 25, always keeps it real. And, here's something you probably didn't know about the Bartia Cardi rapper, she's not the best speller. Cardi took to Instagram to repost a meme, as seen below, from radio host, Charlemagne Thargod, which referenced the Starbucks boycott. Me ordering my caramel makey -e auto at Starbucks during the boycott, the meme, which featured a masked man, read. Clearly the meme about the popular beverage, which is spelled macchiato, was poking fun at the fact that most drinks at Starbucks are quite difficult to spell. Cardi found the meme so amusing that she just had to comment on it, writing, whoever did this meme spells worse than me. Even that sentence had a few grammatical errors in it. However, don't let that fool you. The Bronx rapper is very intelligent, as she's well versed in history, politics and finances. Cardi's posted videos about tax money to Instagram, as well as tweets about social security, which even caught the attention of Bernie Sanders, 76. The former Democratic presidential candidate tweeted that he agreed with Cardi's stance on social security. After she voiced her opinion about the policy on Twitter, Sanders agreed with the rapper that there needs to be a stronger social security policy. Cardi continued to impress the public after she spoke about Franklin D. Roosevelt and his presidency during a recent interview. I love political science. Cardi told GQ in early April, I love government. I'm obsessed with presidents. I'm obsessed to know how the system works, she continued, adding that she used to be able to recite all the U.S. presidents in order of term. Cardi even gave the MAGA brief overview of the 22nd Amendment, as for the Starbucks boycott reference, as seen above. The arrest of two African-American men sparked protests against the coffee chain in mid-April. A manager at a Starbucks in Philadelphia called the local police after the two men were reportedly sitting inside the cafe without having ordered anything. The two men ended up being arrested for alleged trespassing, which resulted in the viral hashtag, hashtag boycott Starbucks. Starbucks CEO Kevin Johnson later released a public apology.